Wait, you're telling me pharmacies didn't always exist? Drop a like right now and comment, I had no idea, because what I'm about to tell you will completely change how you see your local pharmacy. And trust me, you need to watch till the very end. This will blow your mind. So picture this. It's the year 754 in Baghdad. The Islamic Golden Age is in full swing. And guess what? Muslims just invented something that would change medicine forever. The world's first actual pharmacy. Before this, if you were sick, you'd go to a doctor who would mix up random herbs right there on the spot. No standards, no quality control, just vibes and prayers. But Muslim scientists said, nah, we can do better. They opened the first pharmacies, completely separate from doctors. These places had trained pharmacists, proper storage, quality testing, and even prescription systems. The first official one opened in Baghdad under the rule of Caliph al-Mansur. They called these pharmacies Saidala, and they were revolutionary. These weren't just shops. They were like the Apple Store of Medicine. Muslims created medical textbooks, discovered new drugs, and even had pharmacy inspectors to make sure nobody was selling fake medicine. Wild, right? Next time you pick up your prescription, remember, that whole system? Muslims invented it over 1,200 years ago in Baghdad. Hit subscribe on the Muslim Empire for more history that hits different. Drop a comment with if you learned something new. Let's go.